Hello, this is the first instruction video out of three which will introduce you to send to Amazon also known as SDA. You can find the rest of the videos by visiting the help page called create shipment with send to Amazon. The send to Amazon workflow is a simplified shipping experience which aims to reduce the number of steps required to create your shipment. Before you start to create the shipment on Amazon Seller Central, here are a few things to keep in mind. Ensure that you have an exact count of your inventory in hand and ensure you have all the packing materials necessary to safely package your items. On your Seller Central, type shipment packaging requirements to learn what Amazon recommends for shipment packing. Now that we are prepared to send the units to Amazon, let's move forward. Send to Amazon shipping workflow contains three steps. Choose the inventory to send, confirm mm -hmm. shipping and appointment and print labels. In this video, you will know how to read Send to Amazon page and how to choose the inventory for your shipping plan. Let's get started. On Seller Central, you can access Send to Amazon by going to the shipping queue. Click on inventory, then select manage shipments. On the top of the shipping queue, click on Send to Amazon button to enter the workflow. You can also go to your manage inventory page Choose the listing you would like to replenish and click on send or replenish inventory button to start your send to Amazon workflow. Step 1. Choose inventory to send. First, always ensure the ship from address is correct. If you are shipping your inventory from the location other than the one shown, click on ship from another address and select the right address. In case you have multiple ship from locations, then you can change addresses for each shipment when you read step 2. With Send to Amazon, you have the option to either create shipment through a list of SKUs or through the File Upload option. The File Upload option is recommended when you wish to add multiple SKUs to a shipment. To add SKUs using the File Upload option, please follow the steps mentioned on the Send to Amazon page. We will go ahead and select from the List option and move forward to Step 1. Step 1. Choose Inventory to Send has two tabs all FBA SKUs and SKUs ready to send. Under all FBA SKUs tab, you will see the list of all your FBA product listings currently added in your account. You can search any SKU that you would like to add to your shipping plan by searching by title, ASIN, SKU or FN SKU. Send to Amazon may provide you with the quantity and fulfillment center recommendations for your SKUs. You can add the recommended SKUs to your shipping plan with a single click or click on view or modify button to add or remove fulfillment centers or quantities. You can also add a SKU without recommendations by clicking on click here to add fulfillment centers. Once you have confirmed the quantity and the FCs to send, add your SKUs to your shipping plan by clicking on ready to send button. In case you wish to choose FBA pickup service by ATS, Click on Declared Value and Compliance Information button to enter the compliance information. These details will be used to generate delivery chillon or eway bill. Once you have chosen all the SKUs you would like to add to your shipping plan, click on SKUs Ready to Send tab. Here, you can choose Prep category based on your product if you haven't selected before. You can select whether you would be prepping the inventory yourself or have Amazon prep it for you. Please note that prep by Amazon is chargeable. To print FNSKU labels, click on print SKU labels option next to each SKU or print all the labels at once by clicking on download all SKU labels button. If you wish to have Amazon pays the FNSKU labels for a fee, you can select label by Amazon. Once you have selected the prep and labeling for your SKUs, you would be shown an estimated fee for the Amazon services under fee and charges summary. You can move on to step 2 by clicking on accept and continue. Thank you for your time and watching this video. You can view our next video to learn about step 2 that is confirm shipping.